Water is very important to anyone. We all know the oil gas price is really high. You can live without driving a car, without gasoline, but people hardly can live without water for a day or two. I'm a person really into practical measures, and I always believe if, as an engineering major, if we don't prepare or equip students with a practical experience, and also the, uh, the knowledge basis to enhance, to perfect them in the long run, I think that's a failure to professors. So that's why in my teaching philosophy, I always want a student to have a hands-on experience. From as a research perspective, we want to get students get more involved with high-end research, simple like water sensing, monitoring. Also work with those water environmental agencies like Trinity River Authority. They have very good central laboratory to analyze those water. And so typically we do flood analysis in DFW area. And the one thing we use is to use a technology like a radar rainfall information and tied into our real-time hydrologic model to provide us uh, flood warning information because during floods time is very important for emergency personnel and also to residents to take actions. Water is actually a different format from a climate change and we also know global warming and we know that either you receive an intense rainfall within a very short time duration or with a very long time, you don't have any rainfall. And that is why we are actually working with the National Weather Service to look into historical radar rainfall and to understand, and secondly, is or to evaluate what is a typical the rainfall intensity, duration, frequency pattern as well. So that started off uh, that huge data-driven research and to, to investigate those uh, historical radar rainfall and plus also we get into USGS stream gauge information to find a correlation between rainfall and the stream information there as well. Strategically for urban areas and a lot of cities are also facing uh, limited water supply. And how are we going to optimize water resources and manage those existing water resources is a big research question to local communities and also the government as well.